On Tuesday, Gina Lichty was elected the 31st mayor of the city of Goshen, the first ever woman to hold that title. It's great to be the first woman that stepped into office and to be elected for this position in 192 years in Goshen's history. And I look forward to making history in other ways in Goshen. Lichty received 54% of the vote, as opposed to challenger Benjamin Rogers, who got 46%. At the end of Rogers' campaign, what he's most grateful for is the team that surrounded him. We brought together a team of volunteers and campaign staff very, very quickly over a basically a couple week period to, to make this a real contest. And I, I really want to thank them for all the work that they put in. Despite the loss, Rogers says this isn't the end for his political aspirations. Well, my political, uh, I don't want to say career because I've never really made a living out of it, but my political involvement goes back many years and most of it's been behind the scenes. And this is the first time I've ever actually stepped in front of the camera instead of being behind it. So. I think I'll probably return to, to working on a lot of campaigns, working on political issues behind the scenes, working on policy. But you might see my name again on the ballot at some point. I'm not giving up, I can tell you that. While this is the first time a woman has been elected mayor, Lichty has been in office for the past four months after she took over for former Goshen Mayor Jeremy Stutzman, who announced his resignation in April. As you know, I stepped out a little early. Um, knowing Gina Lichty was willing to run after me and take the position, uh, that, that made it possible for me to actually feel okay leaving the office. Um, but Gina, I'm just so proud of her. Uh, the whole Democrat team, they did a great job tonight. Um, and I think Gina's just gonna, she's gonna bring a lot of great things to our community. As she looks ahead to the coming term, Lichty is aiming to find new ways to make an impact. I'm just so grateful to the community of Goshen for choosing me to lead them, and I look forward to serving our community well. Reporting for Globe News, I'm Tyson Miller.